Hocus Pocus, everybody focus on this next lesson teaching cause and effect. For this lesson, you'll need a couple of household items, some apples, some green food coloring, baking soda, and vinegar. You will wanna start by carving out the center of those apples, add your green food coloring, some baking soda on top, and then give the students cups of vinegar to pour on top of that and wait for the results to occur. Then have the students use their cause and effect maps to identify what they saw. Want to level this activity up? Maybe your students need to break the spell or curse of the evil, wicked queen, and you provide them with cause and effect task cards that they have to solve in order to break her wicked spell. Now, we want to remember every student every time, so make sure every student is answering every single one of those task cards independently to get the best results academically. Remember, it's all about finding simple ways to make learning explosive.